kind of set up for the A split here. They've been able to get uh, control over towards switch position. Already had the entry on the Shazam as well. They're attacking the pyramids and they're getting some deep penetration into the site. But now we're seeing Dapper and Tins actually fighting back very effectively. Looking pretty solid. Even trades coming through. Poise trying to keep some space to work with. The Tens has established threat over the middle of the map. Spike is still down just outside of A, and ooh, Poise nearly gets an angle, but can't quite convert the shots, and of course, Tens will punish. That'll Battle be no problem whatsoever, standing. but Neptune looking to at least still get this spike planted, and it does seem like that will be what he's able to go. 1v3 now, but no Bye. chance to get that Bye. off the ground, so Sentinel takes first effect. <laughs> Play over towards game. Able to get a lot of damage done, but can't find the kill. So Superman for progress on that A site spike will go down. Left. And basically the defense is being funneled through defending spawn. Shanks does get caught in mid, however, so it equals the numbers back up, and now Sentinels have something to launch off of. And they're already here to contest that tune. Guiding Light will go through, able to find the flash, but 10 stays alive. Able to get the cloud burst in to gain separation while he's found at the top with the marshal. But Neptune able to take one with him. Derek still part of the play as well, just a little bit deeper. Standing. Good help coming through, but Zoms trades things back. 2v1 favoring the Sentinel's defense, but Derek fully healthy. Not going to be able to find Zoms in time, so it's three for the Viper player of Sentinels. And done round against the Sentinel's trying. bonus. Like, they were able to get some space, able to make some things happen, but Five now they're starting to pick the hard four progression again. Denied early on here. Tins looking for a second. Misses, able to dash away, though, in the base. Dapper though, from the cloud burst, able to find two, tries to spam down for a third. Remaining. Got every single Sentinel member looking at him. And yeah, oh, another boy. Flawless is largely trying to take over the backside of mm -hmm. Curve over towards B. Rotating over though is Shazam, so he's going to be playing top side platform. And this is going to be a really good look for him. Yeah, sees all the information again. No uh, utility needed for that bit of his Zelda. On target. Yeah, they want to step out and grab Neptune as well. Spot Superman, he's done for as well. And Shazam getting all the intel he needs as well as bringing members down. Spots to spike. Does eventually go out, but Dapper and Tins able to trade right back, no problem. And it's going to be 6-0 for Sentinel. The call the full rotation. Oh, Sick is boy. still playing inside B-side. He's still got a teammate in B-Tons. So he's found the opening pick. And that's not great because Zom is watching the cross angle. Oh no, it's all gone wrong. You have to appreciate the energy, but the efficiency of it, not quite there. 15 seconds of the clock. Spike has been alleviated over towards the B zone itself. And of course, all Sentinels are going to rotate left. over. This is going to be another lost round. It, it is one of those that it feels like, okay, Mike Rise, we started to put together the right play. But at the same point, like you didn't really feisty to even pulling out the blade here. Fury Orb comes through, Flashpoint also a mix. Staffer though, watching the corner, oh finds two Down more again. It's just the crossfire setup. How do you get rid of this? Apparently you just don't. All five members will... Yeah, that's just, <laughs> hey, this is... it's, where, where do you go? I mean, this is a, a slice of Swiss cheese with no holes in it. Moment. But Rise, able to find one, but that may be about it. Even trade coming through, even tens with the Sheriff. My goodness. Defending lockdown also in play, and that's going to be trouble here for Ryan. He's going to do destroy it, but there's nowhere to go. Shanks tries to oh dash boy. away, but Tens was waiting for it. And now it's just down to Derek. Up top, Tens. Not going to hit that shot, but that's fine. Sick is there for the assist Not with it all yet. Nope. He's going to have help on the rotation through mid. Here comes the hit for Ryan. All five members coming through. Derek about to find one. Okay, opportunity here. The defensive Toxic Creed, not going to be allowed to see too much, but Zombs is using that to his advantage. So darn well, down, finds two. Beat. Had a really solid read on where the third would have been coming from, but can't quite find the triple, and with that, maybe a chance to actually you get the spike plant. Maybe, honor. but there's Hunter's Fury available, and that is going to stall out that plant right now, and Dapper comes in for a couple off the back of it. Superman is able to respond, but it's still a tough two versus two with Spike still not planted. And Dapper's on the backside. Tried to open up a little bit more space. Sentry turret down. Jake's gonna remaining. get revealed and dealt with. Shazam, you will find that kill, no problem. Super on the corner, can't block down the shots. Had maybe an opportunity for an impressive 1v2 if you could have only if barely. And they still, we, we kind of talked about it when we were watching it over live, was there are some big gaps for not just Rise, but a number of teams when it comes to being at a new map pool and maybe not being necessarily as well versed on it as you need to be. First couple of kills coming through for Sentinels. 5v3 situation, and honestly speaking, Ryze has been trapped here in the middle of the map with Seekers chasing him down. At least we've been able to get Shazam back here, so able to get a little bit of mid control established. They have the push here through A Halls as well by Derek, and he might even be able to get a little bit of a flank off here. Oh, Tins actually spots okay, Dapper okay. and Tins and gets them both, and that is what they finally needed to break something open. It's a nice aggressive flank maneuver. Wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> what, just, what did we just watch? I don't know, but if Sans wins this, <laughs> if there's any information, he will catch the spike in. Nice overhead view of where exactly the snake fight's coming out, and there will not be enough time to defuse here. And Super Beyond that will also not even give the consideration a second thought as he does find the kill. So the potential of a dramatic comeback alive. But Shazam will find first blood that's up the middle of the map.
Shanks walking into sight through the toxic cloud. But he will be revealed, and oh boy. Now all of a sudden, Sentinels trial. will be very aware of the threat, and Seeker Swap to come through, largely just to make sure that there is some sort of an exit here for Shanks. Yeah, lockdown going in here for Dapper, though, to try to kind of entrench on this site. Shanks still able to get the pick onto 10, so they're starting to make some forward progress here, trying to see if they can get all the way and stop this lockdown, but Dapper going to disallow that, and now they're in some real trouble. Just going to commit for the plant, though. Nobody will be detained by this Neptune. Gonna be struck back, and oh my goodness, the damage is severe. Shazam stole a part of this hit. Just not very even rid of the site. We'll find one in a second. The hit still not rotating though as Rise. Sentinel's already taking away a lot of space, but the Cyber Trap will be there for Derek. Able to find one. That'll be a good start for the defense. Yeah, they're able to start kind of backing up and just kind of playing these longer range battles now with the pistols. As Sentinel's still able to close in on Pyramid, get the spike down, get a frag back to himself, get it back into a four and four situation. Now they can just kind of use this wall as sanctuary and kind of force Rise to press forward. Not expecting the immediate response though, but Rise still come away with a three for one. So it is just down to Shazam 1v3 situation, playing a bit more of a passive angle. Does he have a look at where the spike is planted is the real question. No, he does not because there is a wall down in front of him. Oh, but Shazam able to find one, able to find two, but not able to get over the top of the wall for the third. The boy is thinking for the defuse. Boys has to respond to whatever comes his way almost immediately. Tens already through. Trying to work his way onto site. The toxic screen providing a bit of a deterrence, but is it large enough is the question. Boys for one. Again, the double focus that he has to pull. You see him just looking left, looking right. Sentinels are all over this site. They've completely isolated, looking for Shanks to peek. Yeah, Sid gets that challenge. No problem. One more and sit for three. For Meanwhile, Sentinels are able to accomplish it pretty much immediately. And uh, he has a marshal, but especially on the flank, Shanks is trying to make a play from behind. The Seekers, I believe, will scout that out, no problem. Neptune trying to assist from the side door, and Shanks actually down, found two kills. Hey. Not bad. Keeps that the play defensively, maybe alive for a touch longer than you'd like if you're Sentinels, but it all falls down to Neptune, and he will Attackers very quickly fall. Win. So, not too big of a shocker. They are going to see Rise looking to step to the plate here. Look for this B attack early in the pistol. They've already mm. found a pick on the sick. That's going to put a lot of stress now on Dapper. The knife did come out. He thought for a moment it was going to stall Rise out a little bit further because there's just no way to initiate on in. But able to find the crossing picks, and then Shanks finds one beyond it. Neptune taking away some space through the mid. Able to get a regrowth off. That's going to get Shanks nice and healthy for a moment. While Poi is able to get the spike planted. So the retake will be now 3v5. And with 10s only on 12 HP, you don't feel great about Sentinel's chances to get in. No, not at all. This is a very nice barrage from Rise early on at B, getting some nice clean opening picks. No real retaliation from Sentinels. And this is going to be a very tough retake. I can get being so low on health. Eric also playing through B main. Able to find one. Zom's going to turn to see if he can maybe isolate. Tens is still not really a part of the picture as of yet. This is great from Derek. Just keep backing away. Bait Zom's into a very vulnerable position. That's what can you find? Ooh, not much. They need to find a way to put Set on the back foot. And well, Sick is able to get away. The zero point knife did come through to make sure that there was no immediate follow up. So him finding first blood. Zom's there to help Dapper as well. Oh man, it's just any time that Rise starts to chase ground, Sentinels are so quick to rotate, they take it away there almost in one market and back calls, but they don't go about tins in the back. Sam also misses the play in the front of the shot guard coming through, trying to stay alive as Tens, working for space as he did find one of the operators. Quickly rotating over is going to be sick, but even Shazam will fall. So now it is onto the shoulders of Sick. He's been revealed. Neptune wants the fight. One and help from Derek, but Sick oh, changes no. the angle Down and lines beat. the full back. Unreal. Shumpa not able to find anything versus A, which they're happy to do. I mean, they're already here, but Sick is taking care of the back. Planted. That'll allow him a chance now to flank. The spike does get planted, so Rise, you need to respond. And honestly speaking, if you can get this weapon from Sick, maybe there is a chance to hold, still hold the close plan situation. But it is if you can find the kill on the Sick, and there it is. Neptune also in the same breath able to find one on a dapper. So the numbers are 3v3, and it's actually Sentinels that has to respond forward as the Hunter's Fury comes to delay the retake. Yeah, it's a big kill from Neptune as well up tree position. So, the, you know, favorable situation for Sentinels is now being whittled away by Rise, who are playing very intelligently in this small number of situations. They're able to now entrench with the three on one. It's only tens. He's able to pick up a Phantom here. He's got some health to play with, but he doesn't have the time and not even able to find the exit. And honestly, man, I cannot believe Sentinels fumbled the ball there. They had the superior firepower. Into A. They do get themselves set up. They do take advantage of a weapon. Rise now looking to stay aggressive. Gravity well will allow a chance to find sick. And then 
Ten's maybe a bit of an over-aggressive challenge yep. punished by Shane. So now a five on three early for Ryza's offense as they attack it. Yeah, I'm starting to wonder if this round and what we saw last round is going to finally force Sitlis to kind of sit back and respect five one. Yeah, you had your way with them on Breeze, and yeah, you had a couple of good opening gun rounds in this map, but now they're getting a little bit careless in some of these on site, and it's going to come down to Shanks. Headshot. Oh, Shanks does find one on the cross, looking for a second. That'd be big. Wants to chase to down Sit, who will run away over towards the safety of where the Killjoy was positioned with all the utility. Dapper is going to be tested, and boys will left. find the next elimination. But Zom's firing back. Six seconds on the clock. Spike will be planted, no problem, but it's a 4v3, right and with this Cosmic Divide down, it's really on the Sentinels to make the next move, and all three members stacked up towards Heaven, zero point will come out, you also have the ability, potentially try to fight this back from Rise, as you did see a Counter Recon Bolt be placed. But now it's up to Sentinels. Have to get on, have to test it. Superman in the corner. Flash will come through. Superman Isle able to find one isolated. Also gets relief that everybody is up top here. And, oh boy. It doesn't look like Sentinels are really going to have a chance at this. Already backing away from the fight is sick. I'm going to overcommit though. He knows that he could still get hit by B Link or top middle. He's able to get the kill. But yeah, there is Derek right there on the link to get Dapper though. So yeah. there could be a decent defense in place here by the time they get in the site. And with Neptune down, Shanks has to pull out the blades. He's the only initiative of power that is actually here for Rise and Zombs to find one. Not bad to trade. Just am Playing Spike from the corner, able to take a. down the final two. Just down now to Derek 1v3. Not a lot of time to make this play happen and a lot of ground that needs to be traversed. And yeah, it does Ten seem like such a pretty good idea on where Derek previously was and where he probably was coming back. Just to allow Tens a chance to get this angle. The first peak. He's one back to right. My goodness. Sam also oh, enough time to allow left. this fight to get into the site. Find Dapper them. just needs to find the one kill and the round is going to be over. And there it is, this running forward points Spike has down. to sprint Beat. for it. Dapper with the kill, there's not enough time to play. He's got to win this off the kill themselves, but a one flash comes out. Enemy. Dapper finds the second. Through late, how much information will this see? Sir seems like a bunch. Gravity well will be spent. Shanks, though, able to push forward. Rarick able to find first blood. Also sick, detained. Other player is also there, detained as well. So Ryan will have full vacancy to get onto A and hopefully get a plant down sooner rather than later. Yeah, I mean, they get a really strong 5 on 4 first plant now, thanks to the lockdown, as well as some players being detained along the way. Also, just a big kick on the Zombs early on, and yeah, they're just locking this one up, it seems. One enemy Very remaining. positive for them, Sick can't do too much. Last player left alive is Dapper. The 1v5 finds the first. Not necessarily as clean as you're probably going to need. Shock Dark Flash will come out. Just going to use that to not just move forward, but also allow Tens a chance for the Nova Pulse able to get used. Boys finds one. Wants to find more than that. Going to use the turret as a little bit of assistance, but Zombs denies and penalizes a second. So Spike looking to get planted. Shanks is quick to try to rotate over, but there is a door in his way. And oh, oh my goodness, Spike Derek, down a. a little floater comes over the top. Able to find one. Shanks now able to use this door position for a second. That were caught that underneath, but standing. is that actually okay for him? Able to find at least a chance to get one. Shazam able to find the elimination, but oh, stuck beautiful. backside arches and rise off of the shock dart one here. And then he spot that too. That's a greatly wow. timed flash for him to peek off of as well. Does catch Zoms and he's got help right there next to him as he continues to put the pressure here through Market right Neptune down, doubles up. How does he find that third? Maybe this is <laughs> the last bullet on the magazine to discover that one. And now the Trailblazers are coming back as they read this play 100% correctly. The spike has been dropped in. Got Shanks walking walking across. Sentinels have to commit to playing through B main. And there's really no ground to work with whatsoever. And Shanks makes sure there is a shoot it down. But now they know that market is a threat. How does Raj respond? Neptune maybe misses the opportunity. Derek also could not keep a poise playing from the opposite angle of the find one. He knows that there's more established pressure coming through B main. And oh, maybe even gets caught up. The tense doesn't actually read the play correctly. So now Poise gets involved. But Shazam! He's found three with the Sheriff! This would be an ace! And a 1v2, and he's got an left. AR to work with. This is definitely doable. Also has the spike in hand. Wants to try to bail out the Ooh, sound cube. With that gives him defensive room back over at the green. Boy still anchoring here behind the generator. Trying to handle all the utility oh, being lobbed this way, and he does it great. Eight. It's a couple One of big kills. You can knife me out if you want. Does not make a difference. Boys for three. And you can kind of... A lot to go behind it as they're just trying to walk forward. Shock dart, but some man still able to get the kill. Now Neptune. Playing in the middle of Spike gravity down. well, I mean, not able to find One too much, but remaining. does create opportunity for his teammates. Poised for two. Still staying hot here on this defensive side is poised. Dapper, last one left alive. 1v4 would be what he's required to find here. Soldiers for Shanks, the secondary. Like, there's a support system behind those fast-paced attacks. 
And that's what you're seeing there. And I think the big difference maker here was we've seen them often get this tree position. It's that they haven't been able to penetrate deeper than that. They've been caught up by some of the setups on the site defensively, and they can never really get full control. This round, they are able to. They're able to break through the door. They're able to get in there, get picks, and fun on how steep the economy advantage is for Ryze here defensively. Derek, very early, going into the oh. Hunter's Fury, able to convert onto Shazam. Beautifully found. And even beyond that, you did have Shanks kind of trying to make a play through mid-map, but not going to be required to find anything as the first blood's already confirmed. Yeah, this is going to be great. Aldrin's going to come out middle as you well now defensively. Run. Might even be able to figure out Zom's position. Attacking Lockdown comes into play. Neptune, though, just trying to play through it. Turret, though, will probably give his position away. Has to kind of divert back over to Tree Room, but able to get there safely. The man gets flushed out, but he's able to kind of play in the middle of all this utility and still stand firm on the site. Yeah, this is not bad at all. He's actually got a little bit of help as Shanks will rotate up to the top. Neptune, Shanks off to the team, and destroys an opportunity to take down two. Not done yet, Zapper's still part of the play. He's able to find one in response, but uh, every single bit of this hit from Sentinels has been squandered, and a lot of it is just the fact that Ryze survived through the early utility play from Sentinels. Oh boy. Oh. You can see Dapper with Spike is going to come down, and then Trigger gets a front ever oh. the side, but oh, no. Zapper not find anything. Shazam is still part of the play, so he's able to take down one, and with that, it will go trade for trade. We're in a 3v3. Yeah, let's see how the rest of this plays out, because that was a little bit, um... I don't know, like, just yeah, anticlimactic. Keep Sentinels honest through Hookah, but they still will push forward. Here will come out. Shanks playing through the Octagon. Does not expect Zom to delay too long. They're trying to hold the corner. Will find one. Spams holds down the trigger, but can't find a second. It's Tens who collects the kill, and with that, Sentinels will plant. Be a tough retake now for Rise. All three players still stuck in the defensive halls. Trying to come through with their boom bot. Try to get over towards container. They are able to get into the site itself, but... And you still have four members remaining. You still have Sick with the Showstopper as an insurance policy. Spike planted really well for them. Be a very tough ask for Rise. Wow, Sentinels are going to trust that that wasn't a full-on defuse. The only player to check that is Ken. He's blocked by Nettles. Now Dom has to go back forward. Ken's to find the trade. Showstopper comes through <gasps> with the knife. And that's it. He's holding for the defusal. And Rise will One stick it remaining. right under the noses. Front side of Hookah. Shanks just underneath. Hiding inside of the Nebula, a lot of utility getting pushed through, and they actually spam down the wall. Find Shanks, no problem. Poised and Derek, the only players that are responsible for holding on, and Derek unfortunately cannot find Sick. Poised only good for one, and again, Sentinels will collect and be able to find a way to plant here on B. Spike plant. Indeed. Tougher retake, even more this time for Rise. Now they only have two members for this one, but Superman able to find the opening frag pretty quickly there. Shazam, though, quick to respond. Neptune. Gets right back into it, and with Dapper being low on HP, maybe there's a chance. Just comes down to the top of the beacon. His utility once again to get that hookah control. It's always a nice staple to have, right? If you're constantly able to get hookah presence here with your raise, it kind of denies Intel and gives you a bunch of different options, but they're not ready for Neptune being boosted. He's able to get one, then he goes down. Oh, Eric Hunter's Fury locks down Shazam, almost connects with Tens as well. This gains a lot of space for Boys to continue to keep this cyber cage as the only bit of concealment he needs. But the Viper's Pit will provide a bit of a deterrence here. Boys is going to decide to push through this. He does have a couple of the trap wires to maybe keep him safe in case there is some sort of an existential play outside of the Viper's Pit. Defense is rotating quickly. Seekers trying to help clear. Six still holding on to Uka. That will be now Norm. But the Boys going to go right on inside. Cannot find Dapper. Big missed opportunity, so Sentinels still hold with 3v3 situations. Spike has not been planted yet, but it might not need to be. Penn's able to find one more. It's all on to the last two Rise defensive players. Shanks in the corner. He's got an operator and a pistol to use. He does remaining. find one. That will clear the Viper's pit. Derek 1v2, not going to be able to find the first. Sentinels with three kills in the rounds. Up that previous round, Rise now in a very dire position. One way Nebula gives Neptune an opportunity uh -oh. to play from up top. Does find one. Gravity Well will stall the play. Paint shells to follow. I believe he knows that he's got 10 stuck in a corner. But 10 still to slip through. Keeping his life is absolutely I'm massive. Stuck. Yeah, that was big to be able to get away like that. And uh, at least keep yourself afloat. That they are still a man down in 10. Has no way to heal himself back yet. Uh, this is still giving a huge edge here to rise. Great crossfire for Neptune. A. And Shanks here over towards U-Haul in closet position. And looks like they're able to start battling this attack back, though Shazam is able to get one. Gets it into a three on four. Still has some time. They still have spike possession. And they can still double back to the portal. Oh, oh, Shanks does not expect Shazam to bring himself forward past the teleporter. He's going to find oh, no. through Remaining. you all. This has all gone wrong. Zyms left. finds the third. This was a 3v4 oh, favoring Ryan.
Gravity Well will stall them for a bit. Superman, though, gets spammed through the toxic screen. Oh, what a key loss that is. Left. Boys now has to essentially vacate heaven to get onto the site itself. Trying to contest from any sort of point, but Ken seems to know that he's here, and yeah, sure does. Finds the kill, stops respond from the last defender over through U-Haul, and then Derek, who tried to wander on in, denied. Only play available would be Neptune from the flank, as he was previously in Hookah, but Zam reads that as what Hookah, and he looks so hot with the victory, despite, you know, some of the things that went against him early on in the round. A little bit more of aggressive defensive prodding going on here from both sides of the map, successful through B-Long, unsuccessful through Showers. So we stay 4v4, one HP. Superman on 1 HP, that's the big key. But Sentinels are committing forward to get on towards A. Defensively, there is nobody here at the moment for Rise. But still, Sentinels a little bit apprehensive yeah. to go for a quick plant, so they still can fight back. Yeah. The problem is there's no Shanks for Rico, so Superman's stuck on this 1 HP, which makes him such a low factor and being able to have impact on this retake now. Stick looking to go all the way up with these rockets and at oh. least it's the one health player, I guess, for Rise is fake, but still a tough one. Yeah, ultimate versus health comparison. <laughs> Not exactly full value, but the elimination in the space, more importantly, was big. But Neptune can respond of one of his own, able to take down Dapper. Shazam playing from a clutch spot deep through middle. Ten's here to guard him with an Empress. No Space been gained. Run. Neptune get a stick on him. Our spirit coming up. Ken wants to peek through it, and he finds himself too. One more available. Able to still dismiss on the backside of the Hunter's Fury and the finesse from out and weaving around and able to still steal the round away. The aggression here from Rise. And oh boy, it's all gone wrong. One flash will come through. That's just to get the Shanks away from the play initially. Tries to retake, but only good for one elimination. One Looking remaining. good for 10 unless Poise can double up. Not going to be the case, and it's just down to Derek with a Marshall for a 1v3. Yeah, some might Fight say that planted. Bond's looking like a breeze for Sentinels. Hey, hey, hey. Only been one sitting on that ways. one. Now, I, I actually <laughs> oh. just came up with that. No, no lie. I'm really proud of you. Shut down. That's my problem. Here, so. but cage three. Speaking of, Sentinels aggressively through Hookah, and oh my. It's just the, the spam that we've seen a couple of different rounds here through the edge of Hookah hasn't even give Rise a chance to fight back. Seekers from behind, sure, but Shanks is so far away from this play. Derek is trying to delay with the Hunter's Fury. He does find one to his credit. But actually, Shanks doesn't go. Oh, okay. Wow, okay. I thought by the Seekers coming from behind, they would have known that the play was going to be here sooner rather than later, but not the case. The spike doesn't get planted. Trailblazer will see Shazam and Rise could sell for the second round here. Pending. Zombs doesn't oh. do something unbelievable. And well, this is going to be a very difficult 1v2 as he will have to re-aggress back into the site. Yeah, if his teammate could have stayed alive a little bit longer, maybe he finds a way to get this 1v1 against Derek and get in. But now he's stuck in a very difficult 1v2. He does have time. That's about all he's got going for him right now. Trying to find a way in here. Gets it 1v1, but Derek... But Ryze have avoided the early prodding of information from Sentinel's mid-map, and they're looking to re-aggress here. It will cost them an owl drone. Sick will be here to read this. And also still has the paint shell. Oh, my. Just the way that he takes that shell. Unreal. Tens up top. No problem. In the headshot and range. What in the heavens is that? Ryze... No, they don't yeah, know for sure. Yeah. I think maybe he might have got out of it. Oh, that's a nice little shot. You know, a little bit of space. Also has a player trying to get into Hookah at the same time. Oh, Great shot from Boys indeed. But the chase from Sick and Zombs is starting to give them right back the edge. Spike was never a part oh, of the play, though. And Supa makes his way forward. And beyond that, I don't think anyone's read that Shanks is as far past as he's gotten. So the spike will be retrieved. That's Derek who has it in hand. Sentinels are committing to rotate over, but this is a 3v4. Left. where they don't even right. really hold the weapon advantage, so this retake is going to have to be sooner rather than later. Oh, oh I don't like this. I don't like Last this. Player standing. I love that from Zoms, knowing that Sick is in an exposed position. Down below, he had just jumped. He was probably going to get killed, and Zoms is right there running in to make sure he doesn't get trade off of it. Ten seconds left. Again, that is a decisive miss that makes Sentinel so great. Man. Deep into you haul so we are seeing Rise getting a little bit of space here. Now trying to use that with the blast pack to get up there and get a pick, but still able to keep dropping back little by little, but they still wind up folding. Big entries from Rise here. They need this to survive, obviously, and <laughs> at least they're gonna get a plant. That's not bad at all. A lot of that was actually through the chip damage from the decay as well. So beautiful response here from Rise. Let's not get ahead of ourselves though. They've got a long way to go. Regrowth will actually get this team back to essentially full HP, though, so that's good news. And Superman will wind up on the 10s, no problem. Boys looking for the same on the Zom. No, surely not. 
Surely not. Weapon's That's been picked up by Shazam, though. He's got an angle on this. Able to find one. No, don't give him the second. Just don't give him the second. Okay. Oh. That hard for a round. You're already this far behind, and you're up against a low buy. It just... I, I feel like it keeps, like, Sentinels on a mental high. Like, they know what they've got. They know that they're still causing trouble, even when they're... Shanks? No. He thought he was cheeky. Can't have that. Yeah, avoiding the... Boom bot, but not the case. And boys also fall. Not looking good here. 5v3 situation. No room for Rise to work with anywhere on the map. Unless maybe Derek can isolate Shazam here. But I think Shazam did catch the shoulder and is not interested in being gate capped. So people back away. And it really all falls on what happens in this playthrough be long. Yeah, I mean, they have to just send it at this point, but they're already down two players. It's a great setup here for Shazam and Tim. Holding off the composition, not really a way forward for them. Great little trade there, thanks to Shazam. And Zombs. One left. Team 1v3, trying to force it, not going to happen.